This is the 1962 Bristol Low Decker Double Decker Bus. Um, it, I think, would make a great tiny house. Um, it's going to need a complete overhaul or a complete restoration in order to do that. Um, the shell of the bus is, uh, you know, it's, it's pretty solid. Um, there's windows that's been used for a lot of different things uh, over the years, um, but the, the shell is strong, um, but it'll need to be like gutted and, and redone. There's like small issues with like the window, and if you saw back there, this one's missing a window. Here, it was broken out. Uh, need to be replaced. Uh, talked to a guy about the windows and he was like, yeah, super easy, no problem. You pop them out, you re them and everything and uh, they're good. That was part of the restoration. <clears throat> um, that was part of the restoration from a tiny house company. Um, they gave me a $45,000 quote to redo the whole thing and that included like redoing all the windows, you know, adding a bathroom, kitchen, redoing the whole inside and everything. Um, but as you can see, um, like this is uh, the engine. I am pretty convinced that uh, this thing's never really gonna run again. Um, it would, uh, I mean, it could be fully restored and run again, but that would be a crazy amount uh, of money, I think. Um, so the, the styling is there. Uh, this, uh, it's missing a window up there, uh, which needs to be replaced if we don't have the original, uh, window. Um, um, you can see aspects of this. This is why some people are like, oh, can I just drive it? But, uh, this is the original controls. So as you can see, this, uh, this cab is actually not accessible from the rest of the bus. It's it's separate on this side. Uh, but I drove it once, uh, and this is the this is the handbrake, and <laughs> this is the uh, shifter, and I had to uh, use this handbrake to uh, uh, stop it. But as you can see, you know it's uh, pretty pretty old and in need of uh, repair. There's some cool old signs and electronics in there. Um, but this, uh, yeah, that's the outside. So um, we'll go uh, inside now. Um, the doors uh, need some uh, grease here. Um, but uh, these panels and stuff, this is like the panel to the engine compartment and it's here. Uh, it's it's right there. It just needs to be put in place. Uh, we're working on it, so this has been disassembled, but uh, it just needs to be put back in, in place. But as you can see, these are the stairs uh, that go up, and uh, this is really one of the best parts. All the railings and stuff is there. Uh, so all of this good, uh, cool metal is all is all there so you can see uh, the metal surrounding the stairs is, is good it needs obviously some uh, paint uh, this would need to be all you know it would be gutted anyway uh, you know this uh, bench seat could be uh, redone would need uh, you know this would make like a cool little office uh, in the uh, tiny bus with the, like a little writing desk uh, and everything cool mirrors there uh, on the, in the upstairs all the seats uh, are still here um, you know they're dirty and worn I suppose they could be uh, reupholstered but if you're making it into a tiny house you would probably uh, get rid of all these uh, so there's that some lights they're still there So this is, that's the upstairs. We'll go back down here. Okay. And then the uh, downstairs here. 
uh, most of the seats have been uh, removed. Um, so there's this thing here. This is like where the transmission runs through the bus. And obviously like the piece is there, but if you turn it into a tiny house, you know, you'd be putting a new subfloor uh, in this, you, you know, rip up all this, all this carpet and the, you know, the, the floor is solid and you just have to put a new subfloor uh, uh, down in there. This was, uh, they at one time had a bathroom, I think back here. Um, so and they had, you know, cut some holes in the floor. And these seats are over the over the wheel wells, um, and uh, you know some of the cool styling is still there, like these bars uh, and things. Uh, the other thing that's I think really cool is um, all of this stuff here. Uh, these little cubbies where the uh, luggage or your bags uh, used to go. It's like a, a cubby storage cubby way back there that kind of goes under the uh, under the stairs there. So uh, there's another one. But that's the video tour of the Bristol Road Decker. That's the chassis and the body number. 1962 Bristol Road Decker, double decker bus.